Welcome to this template review video. I will be reviewing 10 free Notion templates from 10 different Notion creators on Twitter. The purpose of this video is for other Notion creators to see what it's like to build in public and how they can improve their own Notion templates. I will be reviewing each template according to the practicality, usability and aesthetics. The problem solving aspect, how easy it is to use and understand and also the look and feel of the template. Let's get started. Starting off our list is Pasio with his simple habit tracker template. This habit tracker uses a template button that will generate a new page for a new week. This page contains your morning, afternoon and evening routine as well as a database where you can track your habits throughout the week. The habit tracker is really easy to use, easy to understand and also easy to make changes to thanks to the template button. The only downside with using the template button is that you have to delete or archive the pages after you're done with them. However, the habit tracker itself works amazing and looks great. This template makes use of multi-column layouts and toggle buttons to keep everything organized and I feel it will look even better with custom Notion icons and covers. I'm giving this template a solid 9 out of 10. The next template is a travel hub from CK that helps you plan your yearly travels. At the top you have a yearly summary for all your travels, you have a trip planner and you also have travel resources for your trip. This template is really easy to use thanks to the template button which generates everything you need to plan your next trip. In addition to the nice travel hub cover, I would also add Notion icons to each section as well as improve the headings for each of them. Overall, this template scores a 7 out of 10. Next we have a simple finance planner and tracker created by Rafiki which helps you manage your finances. This template is really straightforward and easy to understand thanks to the useful template guide. You have a summary section at the top and then sections for your balance, income and expenses. I feel this template is missing the element of time as there isn't a date property for tracking your finances. I also think a single database grouped according to the source would declutter this template and make it easier to use. Grouping this database would also allow you to add a sum function next to the group rather than at the bottom of the table. Overall, I'd give this template a 6 out of 10. Next on the list is Atul with the Smart Goals template. This template will help you set new goals and track the habits needed for each of them. On the left you have your goals section to add new goals. On the right you have your habits grouped according to their goal and then at the bottom you have your habit tracker to update your habits. When you add a new goal you can use the template button to add a self-referencing habit tracker database as well as a section where you can clearly define your goal. I love the clean minimalist design and the use of Notion icons. The quote of the day and the widget at the top is also a really nice touch for this template. I think this template deserves a 10 out of 10. Next up is a food delivery tracker from Tyler. This dashboard helps you organize your data from multiple food delivery apps and comes with everything you need to track your income, expenses and mileage as a food delivery driver. You have a monthly progress section at the top, the different apps used for delivering food, a summary for each month and also your main calendar where you can add new trips. This template looks amazing as it is, however I think it would look even better if the monthly progress is shown in a progress bar instead of just text. Overall I'd score this template a 9 out of 10. Next is Frank with the subscription tracker. This template is all you need for managing your subscriptions as it shows you a summary of your monthly and yearly costs and make it really easy to keep track of your subscriptions. The monthly and yearly cost formula will update according to the status, the cost and the billing type of your subscription. You have a view for your subscriptions, a calendar showing the renewal date for each of them and also a view for your subscriptions grouped according to their category. This template is easy to use and understand thanks to the template instructions and also to the different database views. I do think this template has room for improvement when it comes to the look and feel of the template. I'd recommend adding callout boxes to each database and also changing the titles. Overall, I'd give this template a solid 9 out of 10. Next is the OKR project tracker created by Pola. This template helps you plan your goals from a long term, medium term and short term perspective. Your objectives are your goals and the key results is how you track their progress. Your projects is how you make progress towards achieving your goals and each project can have multiple tasks which are then shown on a calendar view so you can easily schedule your tasks. 
The template guide explains in detail how it works, shows examples and makes it really easy to understand. The template is sorted with the most used database at the top and the least used at the bottom and each database also has multiple filtered views making it easy to find what you need. This dashboard is beautifully designed and the use of custom notion icons and the grouping feature gives this dashboard a clean minimalist look and feel. I think this template deserves a 10 out of 10. Next on the list is a one database template from Nandu which helps you store and track all your ideas. This template is useful if you need to brainstorm ideas and have a place to collect and manage them. This template's board view shows the progress of your ideas making it easy to move them around and is also grouped according to the idea type allowing you to keep your ideas organized. This template has a really useful template button that will load an idea validation database so you can further develop your ideas. Overall this template scores a 6 out of 10. Next is the para template from Alejandro. The para method is a way to organize your digital life and this template perfectly executes on that. This template allows you to have multiple areas of your life, each with their own projects and each project with its own tasks. It helps you keep track of what you need to do in a way that is easy to navigate. On the left you have your menu where you can quickly add new notes or switch between pages and then on the right you have your inbox, daily tasks, projects, areas and resources. When you want to add a new project, area or resource you can simply just click on the template button and it will generate self-referencing databases. I think the cover looks amazing and love the use of Notion icons and the gallery view as you can clearly see what's inside and it also keeps everything looking clean and organized. I think this dashboard deserves a 10 out of 10. The last template on the list is a blog post planner by Reims. This template helps you organize your blog posts and optimizes the process from idea to publication. Your blog post planner has a board view grouped according to the publication date as well as a calendar view showing the publication date. On the right you have a page for your archives, a reminder table and also an area to add new article ideas which will show up in the articles database at the bottom. You also have a resources section with a page for your marketing, inspiration, links and ideas. The template button makes it easy to add new icons and also generate what is needed for adding new ideas or articles. I think this template looks great with the colored board view and the headings for the different sections but do feel it requires a cover, maybe some notion icons and also a change in the template layout. Overall this template is great and scores an 8 out of 10. The goal for this video was to analyze and not to criticize. It's amazing to see how creators from around the world use Notion to manage different areas of their life and how each template is designed in its own unique way. I'm curious to know what you thought about this template so be sure to leave a comment down below. If you enjoyed this video I'd really appreciate a like and subscribe for more videos just like this. Thank you for watching, I'll see you in the next one.